Hi everyone, I just wanted to review uh, determining the regularity of a rhythm, um, show you the technique that I use using um, a piece of paper as your caliper or measuring device. Uh, so first you'll start by marking the first RR interval. Make sure your pencil is sharp. Okay, mark the first two. Then you can slide your page over. Make sure that you keep it as horizontal as possible. Um, line it up and then mark the second one. Basically it's the same. Slide on over. Again, line it up. You see there's some mild variability here. Mark the point. Again, line it up. And mark this one, which is slightly wider. Okay. So you can see there is actually some amount of distance here. That's the variability in the RR interval. I'm going to take that and put it on the grid somewhere uh, and actually have a look to see how many small squares of variability that is. It's actually just over one small square of variability. Um, by textbook, uh, the regularity of a rhythm is determined by uh, three small squares or more um, is an irregular rhythm. Uh, and so in this case, this being one and a half to two uh, small squares of variability, this rhythm is regular. Okay? The expectation is that you would use the 1500 rule to calculate heart rate because this is a regular rhythm. Okay? We'll do one more from the textbook 5.3. Same thing, we will measure um, the RR intervals. So I'll mark the first one and the second one. I slide the piece of paper over, okay? Line up the first hash or the tick and then mark the center of this next one. Same thing, I'll continue to slide over and mark the next several. You can see with this one, the point falls within this range that is being established here, so I won't mark that one. And I'll just slide over to check the last two RR intervals. Again, this one lies in between that variability. And same with this one. So in this case, this is the distance or the variation um, in the RR interval for this strip. Okay, again, I'll line this up along the grid somewhere just to count the number of small squares. Uh, in this case, I'm just over four. So I'm between four and five small squares of variability. Uh, so this is an irregular rhythm. In the case of an irregular rhythm, you can count the number of complexes within a six-second strip to determine your heart rate. Okay? So hope this helps. Thank you.